It's hard to overemphasize how amazing bats are. Indeed, they are the only mammals that can fly. Some bats achieve speeds of up to 100 miles per hour in level flight, which is by far the fastest speed reached by any animal. Besides their unparalleled speed, bats are incredibly energy efficient too. Studies that compared oxygen consumption among birds and bats of similar sizes found that bats spend less energy to fly. Their flying ability has long attracted the attention of engineers and biologists. In experiments at Brown University with Jamaican fruit bats, researchers have finally discovered what makes bats the best animal athlete in the world. New research finds that to minimize their muscle work, bats skillfully manipulate the spring action of the wing tendons that store and release energy during flight. Otherwise, flapping big, massive wings over 10 times a second all night would be an extremely exhausting activity. Bats have developed perfectly timed coordination between relaxing and contracting their muscles. When their wings meet the most air resistance, the stretch tendons recoil elastically to make the upstroke, allowing the muscles to recharge for the next cycle. Similar to bats, superior performance in sprinting depends on efficient tendon action through precisely timed relaxation. Tendons are highly energy efficient. They return in an elastic recoil more than 90% of the work previously done stretching them. A considerable amount of energy, which muscles would otherwise have to spend, can be saved by elastic stretching and recoil of tendons. For comparison, only 50% of the energy used in muscle contracting is converted into mechanical work, and the rest dissipates as heat. Additionally, tendons recoil elastically much faster than muscles can contract. Achilles tendon and ankle plantar flexors can jointly produce spring-like forces up to 12 times body weight, almost at no energy cost. Thus, getting more speed without effort is absolutely real if the athlete knows when to push and when to ease off. However, even the slightest overpushing or extra tension in the body severely restricts the tendon action. The world-class sprinter has reached the peak level of athleticism and maximized the amount of force they can apply to the ground at least 30 years ago. Therefore, at the elite level of competition, muscular strength is a bonus, but no longer an advantage. The 100-meter world record has improved over time as the best athletes enhance their running technique and neuromuscular coordination. In other words, the best athletes haven't changed physically very much, Instead, they have become better skilled and relaxed. The running speed is a product of strength and coordination. Since most sprinters have more strength than their tendons can handle, it is safe to conclude that the secret to greater speeds is learning to relax like a bat.